Hi, in this video I've got a little something different for you again. It's not no painting and decorating. It's a little chat about communication. Now communication when you're self-employed. So my name's Stephen from In Exteriors Painters and Decorators and you're watching In Exteriors TV. And in this video I'm going to talk a little bit about communication when being self-employed. Communication is absolutely key and it is one of the most important tools I think to have in your toolbox. Why do I feel it's one of the most important tools to have in your toolbox? Because it can win and lose your jobs for one. Now if a client rings you and you answer the phone it's their first impression of you. So when the client rings you, you answer the phone and say you're busy and you haven't got a pen and paper, what I say is at that point is, is I'll ring you back at a certain time. And then I'll ring them back at that time. Now, if I didn't ring them back at that time and rang them back an hour later, or right, sometimes you can't, but most, most of the times you can, ring them back at that time. So if I didn't ring them back at that time, that's the first little mark against you. Then say you rang them up an hour later and you've got that first little mark against you, then you go arrange to look at the job and then say you accidentally turn up late because of traffic, then that's two marks against you. Before you've even started the job, you might not think that's important, but believe me it is. But if you ring them when you say you're going to ring them, and then you turn up when you say you're going to turn up, then that's two marks that goes for you before you even start the job. Now, this is all about fine lines, but these little things do matter, honestly. Now, another thing, it can relieve stress and worry by communicating. Now, if you're really, really busy and you've took on loads of work and you can sense you're running behind on timescales on jobs before you're getting to the next job because it's rained or you, you're just falling behind time-wise and all this time can accumulate to where you know you're not going to be able to make it to three or four different jobs on, on time. So basically from that point you've got to reschedule your full year, believe it or not unless you work some weekends to, to make it up. And that's the time to communicate again. Because when you ring these people up, nine times out of 10, they're absolutely fine and they'll understand and they'll be patient and wait. But if you don't ring them up and you're carrying this stress every day and thinking, how am I gonna get to them? How am I gonna get to them? It, that does you no good at all. And I, I've, I found it out on quite a big scale last year because I was absolutely snowed under last year and I I was doing this big job then I had these machines um, asked if I could do these machines and I couldn't turn turn it away because then machines were what, six months work or something like that and I definitely couldn't turn it away but I had people penciled in for that six months as well so I had to ring them and say that I'm not going to be able to make it till so and so I was able to I was able to pull off the machines for a short while, for like a week or so, and go and do a job. But I still wasn't getting to those people on time. But the moment I made them phone calls, I just felt, you know, it just I just felt relieved. Do you, do you know what I mean? It was, yeah, it, it was good. I, I suddenly, I had no stress because I'd made a simple phone call. Now, that's why else a phone call and communication is important. Always answer your phone. I mean, sometimes you're going to be too busy to where you can't answer it, but answer it or ring them back at your at the soonest point you can because you never know. That could be your next big job. That could be six months worth of work. Just you know, and or or, or if you ignored that phone call and thought, oh, you're too busy is what it is. That that could go and that could cost you work in the future so trust me i've done it answer your phone when you can or, or as soon as possible and as quick as possible or if not when you can right that's my little chat about communication if there's anything more you would like to add to that please do so because this is about helping 
everybody and, and everybody can have an input in this and that's how we all grow. So thank you very much for watching and take care.